big property announcements coming out from all over the place, really, here in Dubai, with the arrival of uh, Cityscape. And uh, a very big announcement yesterday from uh, Khalaf al Habtour, the chairman of the al Habtour group, relating to the plot that uh, the Metropolitan Hotel used to uh, stand on, where they're putting up three hotels. We are very pleased now to have on the line Mr. Khalaf al Habtour, the chairman of the al Habtour group. Good morning to you, um, Mr. al Habtour. Salam alaikum. Oh, Good morning, Mr. Michael. Thank you very much Thank for um, thanks very much for joining us. Um, we have, we've heard before that on that plot where the Metropolitan used to stand, you're putting three different but big hotels. Um, what has changed from that announcement? What did you come out with yesterday? The changes is the addition, really. I mean, the hotels we are go, I mean under construction now, which is three hotels, uh, five star and luxury, plus the theatre, which is the first. Not, uh, the first in Europe and, and Middle East, only in Las Vegas and Macau. This is a live and permanent uh, theater. Uh, this, uh, then we improved by the expansion of the three towers and the boulevard, uh, which it looks over the, uh, the canal. With, we had great cooperation and uh, coordination with RTA uh, to organize and to make great out of uh, uh, our partnership. Uh, this is uh, something really an addition landmark after uh, uh, Burj Khalifa and Burj Al Arab and we think this will be a very, very uh, invite inviting uh, site, inviting a place to everybody, not only to the people resident to the country, and, but also people, they will come purpose to see the theater and this project. You say that this is going to be uh, after the Burj Khalifa and the Burj Al Arab, um, sort of the, the next on the list, if you like. How is it going to be different from all of the other towers? <coughs> is there something special about it architecturally? Yes, sir. Uh, number one, uh, it is an isolated land. It is not within the other, like, uh, building next to building. This is uh, an... Uh, I call it an uh, uh, an island, which is you know uh, isolated uh, opposite uh, Hyde Park. Uh, sorry, Hyde Park. I mean uh, Safa Park, and on the side the canal, and on the left there is nothing uh, except the flyover, and in the back is empty government uh, plots which is belong uh, to His Highness Sheikh Mohammed, the stables. Therefore, we are we are isolated a proper. A sort of an island and this has every single thing I mean available there will be a clinic there will be pharmacies there will be a supermarket available for the resident the people will be visiting every day according to our calculation is the access of 20,000 people and uh, this is important to us and uh, you know this will have the hotel itself about 1,616 uh, room and the suites. You know, when we say 1,616 room and suite, sometimes some suite has three bedrooms. It means really it goes an excess of uh, 1,800. You say plus you have 1,460 uh, apartment and penthouses. So about 33,000 rooms in total. I mean, that's an awful lot to yes, squeeze sir. onto that plot. You say the, the plot stands like an island around there, uh, yes. Safa Park opposite, government land behind. Um, I was actually surprised, because I used to go to the gym at the, the Metropolitan Hotel, and to me, that uh, it seems like an awful lot to go on one plot. You've got the three hotels, the three yes, residences. You've got a water-themed feature, French gardens, tennis academy, clinics, etc., sure. etc. Et um, it sounds like the current building site could get a bit crowded. No, sir. We are leaving about uh, uh, 350,000 square meet, uh, square feet just for landscaping and gardening in front of the St. Regis Hotel. Our land is huge land. It is 1 million square, uh, 1 million square foot, which is, you, you will not find it in Dubai. Once on Sheikh Zayed Road, 1 million square foot of uh, plot, it is, it is like a jewel. This will be the jewel of Dubai. And Mr. Al- sorry, carry on. Yeah, therefore, I mean, it is, it is, I mean, 
now planned, it is planned since a very long time, I mean, since maybe 40 years, this uh, plot of land, by uh, the late Sheikh Rashid bin Saeed uh, and myself. So, I mean, it is a unique, unique land, a unique uh, plot. It is in the heart of Dubai. Therefore, I mean, and the land is huge. And, Mr. and the purpose, you know, we are putting the hotels together and the apartment in the back, and we are putting uh, and it is over, and the, you, you know, you can see any in your vision is 360 degrees.